Welcome back to the channel, I'm Dr. Gluon. So many people tell me that I'm not a great house builder in The Sims. I could build stuff, sure, I can build lots of things, but when it comes to houses, I don't know, I'm just, it's just not fun for me. So I'm not like, love, I just don't love house building. But you know, I've seen all these like AIs out there. These AIs are creating all kinds of artwork and stuff and things. And so I'm thinking if an AI can do all this stuff, maybe an AI can help me build a house in The Sims 4. So that's what we're gonna do today. I'm gonna be having an AI help me with the exterior, the floor plan, and every room in the house. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button. And if you like this kind of video, hit the like button. It really helps out. Anyway, let's do this. All right, so we're using Dream AI. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna basically tell it to create a house. And then we're gonna build the exterior. And then we're gonna build the interior. I'm hoping that by the end, we're gonna have a pretty amazing, a pretty amazing house you know gonna look like something you know maybe james turner or a little simsy built maybe even better i don't know all right so we're gonna put it in the sims 4 house let's see what we get let's see what we get okay here we go okay uh um okay um so looks like uh a lot of stairs with some plants in front of it and some kind of blue building upstairs um i'm not really sure this is a is this a house do you know this is a house do you know is this a house i'm not sure this is a house all right let's go back for a second let's go back uh how about exterior sims 4 uh let's just go two story house two story house that way you know give it some um give it a guide you know okay okay this looks like a house that looks like a house in the sims 4 it looks like two houses in the sims 4 totally doable i could do that yeah, yeah totally okay we got that let's do that one okay so we got uh two stories there looks like there's like one roof here i think the roofs are kind of like a little curvy maybe all right, that's what we've got so far looking pretty good i've got some of the windows in place it doesn't match up exactly like we have in the picture but um you know it's it's uh what i can do in the sims 4 now obviously i've only got the exterior here and i have no idea what the interior looks like like the layout i've always had a hard time figuring out like what's the you know the layout of the building gonna be so let's just go ahead and ask the ai to create the layout for us and then we'll just copy it right first floor layout to see what happens now, hang on first floor house layout you know give it something else uh uh um um uh, uh um so, so um don't know what i'm looking at here um come on ai help me out here all right hang on a second if i do that but then also they've got this isometric version here uh this is kind of like how sims 1 looked so let's see uh, what this looks like same prompt just with this style okay here we go yeah this is it oh yeah totally look at this oh this is perfect i think <laughs> not sure what i'm looking at but it's perfect so we got you know some kind of room here some kind of is it like a bedroom there um so this there's a room here so yeah no this is this is good this is good obviously you know uh there's a garage on this side and on the outside that doesn't look like a garage but maybe it's like a hidden garage you know like um you got windows here but actually that's a garage or a swimming pool i'm not quite sure what we're looking at but this is gonna be that there and on this side we have the living room which goes all the way back there like that let's add some lights in here right nice and then and then the stairs will be back here right here and then maybe like here's like a closet or something or a bathroom could be a bathroom a very small bathroom oh also the kitchen is right here S so come in here uh you go into the kitchen that goes into also there's like a corner bit here that i see um i don't know what any of this is honestly it's gonna be great it's gonna be great james you better watch out buddy you better watch out because I'm coming for your job, James. You're no longer going to be the king of house builders. I've got a little tool that's going to help me get to the top. Your reign of house building terror comes to an end. Because I'm going to be using a tool to get me to where you are. You know? All right, so there we go. There's the basic layout. I think it's good. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to hone in on each room and ask the AI what the living room should look like, you know? Because I can kind of see it in this picture, but I'm going to hone in on each room, you know? What does a living room look like? Right, let's go uh, Let's go living room. Uh, living room in a Sims 4 house. And we'll go with the isometric style, since I think that's helpful. 
Here we go. Yeah, there we go. Um, um, there's a whole lot of things happening here. There also seems to be at least five different wallpapers involved, so that's fun. Um, hmm. Okay, they seem, and they also seem to have some kind of conversation pit here. And is that a bedroom upstairs? Um, I mean, obviously, it looks great because the the AI made it. All right, so we start off with the white wall, which looks pretty good, and it seemed like there's like blue kind of sprinkled in there. So we'll do like that and like that one there. Also, there's like a brick bit, which I thought looked pretty good. Put that right there. All right, I'm gonna raise this platform up as well. So it looks like. That's on a separate platform right here. You see that? All right, that's looking pretty good. I'm liking it. It's got uh, all the wallpapers there. So for flooring, we're gonna go with something wooden like this. And then again, it looks like they have um, some kind of tile area, like a stone tiles or something down here. Let's make it a conversation bed because all houses need conversation pits. All right, so there we go. There's our living room uh, and bedroom, downstairs bedroom. I think it looks kind of nice, you know? Got this, like, conversation spit with the TV there. And then upstairs is a, a bedroom. Uh, so, you know, like, for guests and stuff. Uh, so that, that looks good. All right, so onto the kitchen, which is going to be this room right here. It's a very small kitchen because there's a big garage next to it. I guess I can make it a little bit bigger by one there. Okay, that gives me a little bit more room. So let's go to ask the AI what a kitchen should look like and then build it. That is, um, that is, <laughs> what is the kitchen the entire house? What is this? Okay, so we have the kitchen here, then we have a corridor, and then we have a separate room for the place where you eat food. And then we have another room over here where we call the plant room because it's a plant in there. There's no doors at all. Uh, <laughs> we could take, um, we could take inspiration. Luckily, I don't see a bed in this room, so that's good. Actually, what I could do, because I've got this, like, extra little room bit here, I could make this to, to like, please the AI. I could make this little room be the eating room, since the AI seemed to like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we'll, <laughs> we'll put the little table in there. Uh, the AI really liked that idea of having a separate eating room, separate from the kitchen. Okay, so the wallpaper's, like, green. Like a puke green, it looks like they chose. And then the eating room is, like, a gray. Like a puke gray. Okay, so there's my kitchen. Uh, you can see there's like a mini dumpster in there. That's because I think that's what that that yellow object is. It's like a mini dumpster. I don't know why the AI put that there, but uh, there it is. Also, I did include the mini eating room, which I thought looked kind of nice. And this lovely brick part of the wall looks very nice. It's a very nice kitchen. Not functional. There's no sink and there's no <laughs> fridge in there. But the AI didn't include that stuff, so... I didn't put it in there. What I did include is a bunch of plants. And I definitely have a lot of plants in here. So, yeah, there's my kitchen. It's looking pretty good. All right, so we're going to look up a garage now. Let's keep it isometric, because uh, that seems to be working out for us. And see what we get. Okay. Yeah, I mean, um, that technically is a garage. Uh, um, maybe we need to put in the interior of a garage. Let's try interior. Okay, here we go. Yeah, there's a, there's a garage. It looks really big, and there's two cars in there. And is that a bike? What's that over there? Is that a bike bicycle? Maybe. Okay, yeah. That's gonna be... That's gonna be right here. That's gonna be our garage right here. So, I don't think we can fit two cars in this garage, but I can definitely uh, be inspired by it. There we go. There's our garage. I got a bike in there. I got a car. It's pretty simple. It's probably the most normal-looking room. Except the fact it has, like, you know, regular house windows around it. It is the most normal room in this house so far. Which is great. Which is great. Score one for the AI. Also, here's my hallway. It's kind of simple looking. I, I, I kind of went to the original picture to figure out what it's supposed to look like. And that didn't tell me anything. So I just put, like, a little seat in here and a plant. And some uh, wallpaper up. Yeah, I think it looks pretty good, though. So, yeah, downstairs is done. There is no bathroom in this house uh, because AI doesn't, you know, AIs don't use the bathroom. So they have no concept of what a bathroom is. Hopefully upstairs, there's some kind of bathroom up here. But first of all, we got to ask the AI to give us a floor plan for upstairs floor. All right, so we're going to say Sims 4 house, second story floor plan. Hopefully... This gives us a good one and also gives us a bathroom. Okay. Um, why does this look like not the second story? Why does this... There's a pool? There's a pool in the second story? This, this is not the second story. Uh, AI, what are you talking about? All right, all right. We're not going to go with this one because that doesn't make any sense. Let's say Sims 4 house upstairs floor plan. 
All right, a little different. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I see a floor plan. Right. I don't see a pool this time, so that's good. Um, and actually, this kind of looks like the, how, the, the original exterior because we've got the two different buildings here. Right. We have a bedroom here, a bedroom there. This looks like a bathroom. And this looks like a, another room full of stuff and things so yeah i think i can work with this all right perfect yeah so we'll build you know this is just a general idea of what it should look like you know so it looks like there's like a corridor or you know kind of a split in between okay um also maybe we're just kind of bring in like this this uh, wall then it's gonna look a little goofy on the top but maybe it's gonna give you some characteristic you know so we're gonna bath from here and a big and a big bedroom there and on this side we have kind of like a bedroom a bedroom and a bathroom there's two bathrooms on either side i guess we could make one of them a bathroom and then one of them like maybe something else like a study yeah this is looking good this is looking really good oh also there's another like story up here which i haven't i haven't uh haven't done yet so probably should do some kind of stairs to get up there maybe this could be like a, a stairs to get up the top hopefully the ai not mad at me for going off script yeah like that and then you know like this is like a little corridor area and then you can go up to this area up here so again i don't know what's up there maybe a pool maybe that's where the pool is i don't know but we'll figure that out later so let's start off with the bedroom this main bedroom in here what is that gonna look like let's ask the ai let's ask the ai uh what this what is this what 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 is this i asked for a bedroom not like every what this is like a floor plan Come on! Well, I can't use this. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Can I just say, um, Sims 4 upstairs. Let's just say, let's say Sims 4 house. Sims 4 bedroom. Let's just say Sims 4 bedroom. Ah, here we go. Yes. Uh, okay. Uh, also, this, this AI loves plants. They love plants. So, a lot of plants. Looks like half of it is outside. And are those three beds stacked on top of each other somehow? Okay. All right. Yeah. We're not going to deny what the AI wants. What the AI wants, the AI gets. AI knows all, okay? Okay, yeah, there we go. That looks really good. Kind of like what they're going for here. With them. It's, like, it's like beds, but in a step, you know? So that way, if you're on this top bed and you fall off, you'll fall off on the bed, blow it. And if you keep rolling, you'll just kind of roll down the bed the bed steps, you know? It's going to be great. Uh, not kind of not very functional as, as a Sims thing, but I think, like, conceptually, it's very interesting. And I think the AI is onto something here. Okay, so then we have, like, a little bit of a garden area here. So a little bit of hedge there. And then should we <laughs> should I do a pee-pee bush in here as well? No, no, it's too, not enough room for it. Maybe, like, uh, yeah, like another little bush here. Maybe we'll put a sink in there. Maybe this is where we get the sink in. Because since there isn't one in the actual kitchen. And I think that's it, actually. I think that's actually pretty much the room there. There's no door. Let's put a door in there. Like that. Perfect. Yeah. That is um, that is the bedroom. Looks looks just just looks just looks like it. I mean, obviously, that's a bigger room. So there's a lot more going on. But it was kind of like this part of the room here. I think we nailed that. I think we nailed it. Um, okay. So the next room, let's do the bathroom here. See what the AI thinks the bathroom looks like. Which is interesting. Because AIs don't use bathrooms okay yeah okay i can see stuff I, I can, yeah okay okay um it's focused on a trash is that a trash can inside the shower was that is that a toilet is that a what is that is that a toilet or was that a trash can that might be a is that the shower i don't know but it looks very nice i don't see a lot like, I can't really see the whole picture because only, like, a little bit of it. But I'm getting the idea. We can do, like, right here, like, a walk-in shower here and a couple of sinks on this side. Yeah, definitely. We can do this. Okay, so we have, like, a little uh, step down. This is actually a very easy room to make, I think. You know, I'm just going to go ahead and say it is a trash can is what we're looking at. But we're going to go ahead and put that trash can there. And then we'll do one of the showers here like that. Okay, there we go. I feel that's looking pretty good. We got the um the, the toilet trash can there, the shower, a couple sinks, a mirror. Uh yeah. It is a bathroom. It is a bathroom. Okay, so on to, uh, I guess, the next bedroom. This is a small bedroom, so I should probably specify that in the AI. Okay, that's, um, that, is a that is a tiny bedroom. It's a little bedroom for mice. It's a <laughs> you know what? Let's do a re-roll on that one. It's too small. That's too small. Let's do a re-roll. 
Another one. G give me another one. Give me another one. That is also very small. But there's a lot more detail on this one. Yes. And, and it actually looks like uh, this might be for like a teenager, maybe. You know? So I'm going to go with this one. All right. We're going to go with like a pink carpet. That's good. And then obviously like teal wallpaper. Yeah, that's looking pretty good as a wallpaper color. I actually really like that. And then the pink floor. Looks really nice. Okay, so we want a pink bed. Like that goes there. Probably should put a door in here as well. Actually, we put it like further over. And uh, we put like a nightstand right there. Maybe like a shelf or something along here. Along where the windows at. These windows are kind of low. We can make them a little higher like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we can put like a shelf along here. And that could be like almost like a desk. Okay, so this room's looking pretty good actually. Actually, this, this room is probably the best looking room out of the whole bunch. Look at this. A desk here, bed. It looks like a nice room. Okay, so for this room, we're gonna say this is like a study room. Since we only have like a bathroom on this side, we're gonna make this like a study. Let's type a home office. That makes sense. Yeah, see what we get here. Yeah, there we go. Basic, you know, there's no thrill to it. It's just a desk, a chair, and a painting. Pretty simple. Kind of too simple though, right? Let's try this. The most amazing home office. There we go. Um, what, uh, what are we looking at? I mean, it's the most amazing. You know, you've got that in your room. That's pretty good. Uh, that's like the exterior. That's like the outside. We want the interior. We want interior. All right, we're going to change this up. It's going to be the most amazing gaming room. Not even an office anymore. This is a room for gaming. We're going to be gaming in this room. And it's the most amazing one. AI, what we got? Show me. Uh, um, those are the platforms. Okay. Uh, I don't see a lot of games in there, but I guess it's kind of cool. It's, it's colorful, I guess. This is literally the most amazing gaming room. So I think we, I think we have to go with it. I don't know what the most amazing room look like. Clearly the AI does. And that's what it looks like. So yeah, let's go. Let's go with this. Let's go with this. See, so you're all thinking like here. The AI, the AI is thinking, like, up here. Okay, so, again, what's cool about this is that the AI loves platforms. And we can do platforms, so I'm going to do this here, and then this here. Right, like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I put, like, this on there? Can I put... Okay, and can, that fills up the entire room. Is there anything, like, smaller that's a gaming room? Can I put the, <laughs> can I put the bowling alley in there? No. That's okay, then ask for a bowling alley. Because, you know, it, it's a small room. Like, look at it. It's pretty simple. It's got a platform, it's got some carpet, it's got a this thing. It's simple, but it is also the most amazing. So it knows what it, it knows what it wants. I know what it wants. We'll put like the Don't Wake the Llama game right here. What colors does that come in? Uh, anything funner? Does it come in like a different color? Like a fun color? What's this thing here? Oh, like a toddler? Like a toddler thing? Hmm, it's not really fun, is it? That's kind of fun. That's kind of fun, I guess, table-wise. Oh, this is kind of fun. Oh, yeah, actually, I like this. This is really fun. I think this is what the AA wanted. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I went kind of above and beyond here, and I added a slide, because I thought that was important. This is the most amazing gaming room, and I wouldn't be able to make this without the AI helping me. So that's, that is great. That looks really good. Okay, so that's looking good. Now, the last room is the one upstairs here. Not sure what this is, but if you look at my house right now, you may notice there isn't actually a toilet. There's also not a fridge. So we definitely want to um, make a room that has, one, a toilet and also a fridge in it. And that's what this room could be here. Have a multi-purpose room, maybe. So let's stick with the most amazing. The most amazing room that has a toilet and a fridge. The most amazing room that has a toilet and a fridge. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. All right. Um, that's the most amazing room. That's the most amazing room. It has a toilet. It doesn't even have a fridge. That's not the most amazing room. What are you talking about? Okay, we roll that one. We roll. We roll. It says, oh, um, it has two toilets, actually. And then a miniature train set, I think, is what that is. I think I can work with this. I think we can work with this here. Yeah, it's got a... <laughs> maybe... I don't see the fridge, but maybe the fridge is somewhere off screen. You know? I do like that it has two toilets. It's handy. I'm gonna go with a hallway here. Okay, so what we'll I do is... Because I, I like the door. I like that there's a door here that kind of comes in. So I want to include that. And obviously the train set. 
Not sure what's gonna go back in in this room. Maybe like nothing. Okay, so that's looking good. We've got the two toilets there. The, the, obviously the door. Uh, I think they do have a shower. Well, we're gonna put a shower up here as well. Again, very important. We need to have that train track or something right there. They have that map thingy from cats and dogs, which I think would look good there. Yeah, this is what I'm thinking of right here. So I know it's not like, that's not like a train track or anything, but it's kind of cool though. It's kind of cool. I like that. There is no fridge in this room, at least pictured. So let's assume it's off camera and put a fridge somewhere in the back. Doesn't make a lot of sense, but let's put two of them anyway. There we go. That's kind of the upstairs room, the fridge and toilet room. Uh, outside looks a little weird now. Let me fix, you know, obviously this roof problem. Can actually, you know what? If I, you know, if I did like that with the roof, is there a way to get out there from here? No. In the bathroom? <laughs> Should I put a door in the bathroom? If I put a door in the bathroom, then it could be like a little balcony. It would be kind of weird to have a door in the bathroom that goes to a balcony, but it's probably actually not as weird as the rest of the house. So, you know what? We're going to do it. We're going to go off script here. We're going off script and uh, we're doing what we want to do. Because it's kind of a nice little space there, you know? We're using the AI. The AI is helping us create this house, you know? We're, we're doing it ourselves. The AI is guiding us. It's giving us a lot of the ideas, but ultimately it's our house and we can do what we like. Actually, if I do like, just now I can just take this whole roof and bring it back like that. It's not too bad, actually, you know? This is like a little cut out there. Maybe we put a barbecue in there. Again, I'm not, this, this is me now. This is all me. I, I'm, the AI is not telling me to do this. I'm doing this. This is all glue on. All right, I feel like it needs a little bit more, you know, um, windows or something. Some kind of windows, maybe, in places. Maybe some windows on this side of this room. The AI did not have windows pictured here, but again, it, like, it looks good on the outside of the house to have some kind of windows down there. And also some more windows up here as well. All right, yeah, there we go. So, perfect. Anyway, there we go. There is the house. It's done. It looks amazing. It's got a lot of life to it. It's got a lot of plants. It has a dumpster inside. It has the most amazing game room. And it has the most amazing room with two toilets and two fridges. So what do you think? You like it? Did the AI do a good job? I think it did. Anyway, that's gonna do it for this one. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye!